took some time and I decided I wanted to get in the studio and start working again and, and make an album full of original music. I just wanted to collaborate with great people. Whether I wrote the songs or I didn't write them, I just wanted to get in a room. Great producers, great songwriters. It felt like the right time. I felt like I had a lot to, to talk about. I just got in the studio and did what made me feel good or bad and uh, worked through it and I hope people can just maybe get one little moment when they have some goosebumps or feel like uh, they understand where I'm coming from and maybe they also hear parts of my voice that they haven't really heard. I'm always autobiographical. I usually, you know, um, wear my heart on my sleeve to uh, a fault. I just, I don't know how else to, to do it. If we're as authentic as we possibly can be, that's the way that, you know, you reach people as a performer. I chose to call this album Adina because I, I want people to understand that I'm just sort of being my truest self and sort of poured my heart out into this album. This is me kind of stripped down. This is who I am in this album. I just tried really hard not to put the pressure on myself and to just be creative and feel free and try a bunch of different things. And it was a, really one of the most wonderful experiences I've had making an album because I wasn't as hard on myself. And as a result, I think I, you know, did something I'm, I'm really proud of.